So let's talk about living in Santo Domingo and the price of of living here, the uh, what that budget could be every single month. So the minimum budget I would say to live here would be about a thousand dollars, and that would include rent. But you would definitely be renting, you know, somewhere where. Uh, you know, three to five hundred dollars a month. You can find places like that. I'm not going to tell you that it won't be. You know, I don't feel like it's unsafe here, but you know, for three to five hundred, you're not going to be like in the best neighborhood. You're going to be in a safe neighborhood, but not necessarily the best neighborhood that's near shopping and restaurants and that sort of thing. Um, and then I, you know, you can eat for. $50 a week here or less. I mean, if you cook at home, the produce here is amazing and it's very expensive. There's an amazing open air market here called La Feria and we go and eat there once or twice a week and it's a hundred pesos and I have enough food for lunch and dinner for a hundred pesos. That's like a dollar fifty, and it's amazing. You get rice and beans and salad and cooked vegetables and fish for a dollar fifty for two meals. Um, yeah, so you can eat pretty inexpensively here. I, I absolutely love cooking here because the produce is so amazing. Um, I eat a lot of avocados here, a lot of mangoes. Um, I fry plantains almost every night. I get fish here from Price Mart, which is a really great place here. It's like Costco. Um, they have fish for, you know, four beautiful fresh pieces of fish for five or six dollars. So you can you can live here uh, for under a thousand dollars a month. Um, if you don't have a car, then you don't need to worry about insurance. Ubers here are very inexpensive. You can get in an Uber for a dollar fifty two dollars. It can take you almost anywhere in the city. Um, you know, insurance. Uh, there's a couple different uh, places you can get insurance from. You can get government insurance if you're not making a lot of money. Um, and that's actually free. There are other insurance plans here that you can get for a hundred, two hundred, three hundred dollars a month. Um, let me see what else there would be. So that's you know food, rent, insurance, um, transportation. So if you're traveling, you know I go to the beach every single weekend, and you can find a place in inexpensive beaches like Boca Chica for twenty dollars a night. So you know you could even go to the beach for a couple nights. Um, a month for you know under a thousand dollars total. So yeah, I think that that includes the basics um, here. If if you don't have a car, you know obviously if you have a car, you're gonna it's gonna be you're gonna have to pay for the car and then you're gonna have to pay for gas, which is really expensive here. And then also insurance, which is pretty average. I think the insurance cost here is pretty average comparative to the United States. So I think that's everything. Um, yeah, about a thousand bucks. Uh, you know, I spend about 2000 I do live in a big tower, you know, right on the beach in the Malacone Center. Um, so I spend about a, a 2000 a month. But that's just because, you know, we live in a, in, a, in a nicer place with a huge pool and, and that sort of thing. So it really just depends on what you're looking for. You know, that's what's so great about here is that between a 1000 and $2,000 a month, you can live very, very well here in the Dominican Republic, where in the United States it would be, Considering where I live, if I was in, you know, L.A. or New York or even some places in Colorado or Seattle, or Seattle I'd probably be paying $5,000 at least for the way that I live here. Um, so, you know, double, almost triple what I pay. So as far as electricity, gas, A.C. and Internet goes, it depends on where you're living. Some places have it included, some don't. Um, I would say the total for all of that can be somewhere around $100, maybe $200 if you're, you have AC going all of the time. But yeah, for electricity, gas, wireless internet, um, you know, TV is usually included in that and even um, a telephone line. So I'd say between $100 and $200 a month would get you all of that.